Bali Kota Beach is located near Bali Zangirai Airport, only 15 minutes drive by car from the airport. It is the most famous beach resort on the island. Kota Beach is the bustling area with the most tourists in all over Bali. In the past, it was only a very small village. Nowadays, it has developed into a prosperous tourist resort. On the beach, there are many peddlers along the street, selling various local specialties, such as crafts, t-shirts, beach clothes and accessories. As the beach is windy with high waves, it is not suitable for boating or swimming there. But it is an ideal place for windsurfing, which is favored by the young who look for excitement. It is also an ideal place for watching the beautiful sunset. At night, there are local Balinese singing and dancing, performing especially for tourists. Kota Beach is just like a holiday paradise with a beautiful clean beach, numerous shops, bars, restaurants and shopping centers. Kota Beach is not only a unique scenic spot for sunbathing and water activities, but also a perfect place for watching sunset. The commercial area in the center of Kota Square is a new and modern shopping skyscraper. Kota Beach History Since the 18th century Kota has served as the entry for foreigners visiting southern Bali. In the 1830s Kota was a thriving slave market, attracting a wide variety of interrogation national lowlifes. Since its rediscovery by hippies and surfers in the 1960s, Kuta and Legion have expanded so rapidly that the district is now one of the busiest tourist areas in the world. At 300 years ago, in this place had been built a Konka, Buddhist temple, located beside of Tukatmati, Dead River, where a river can be navigable at that time. The boat steps into the hinterland of Kota, so that Kota is a port trade. Madeleine is a merchant from Denmark in 19th century and had built its trade station in the river Prithnagationary. During living in Bali, he often becomes the medium between King of Bali and Dutch. Madeleine has mysteriously died and his grave is located inside of Kanka, Buddhist temple, right in the river periphery. Kota is quiet fisherman countryside in the past, but now it has been turned into the hilarious town and it is completed by post office, conagation lice office, market, pharmacy, photo center, and shop. There are a lot of hotels which are designed luxury and comfortable setting alongside of white sandy beach of Kota. Kota Beach Nightlife Party Central Kota at night refers to the area extending about 7 kilometers north of the original village of Kuta. This area now includes Legion, Semnyak and even the San Kaza. The Kota area is the epicenter of Bali's nightlife. The majority of Bali's better entertainment places offer anything and everything a night owl would want. Located at the center of the original village are Kota's many open-air pubs and discos. Entrance to bars is usually free with special drinks promotions and happy hours from 6 p.m. to 9 p.m., and sometimes even longer. Jalan Legion and Jalan Padma have the biggest concentration of watering holes. Take up the option of joining surfers to Znagation Sabir, play pool and watch surfing videos at Tubes Cafe, or drop by the eye-catching and uniquely sailship-shaped bounty Reznagation Torandi, which sways to the music of its dance floor till dawn. Other happening out negation lets in town are the trendy 66 club, but say double six, and hyper chic gado gado. For Kota's magnetic live music, the Macaroni Club is irresistible. One of Bali's latest and most extreme negation denari, this place jazzes it up every Sunday from 10.30 pm and invites guests to jam along on Friday nights. For a rare and special combination of Balinese dancing and rock bands near the beach, head straight for the 06 and tube and while the new hard rock cafe draws the crowds with live music and pricey drinks. Other live music spots include the Aussie style pubs along Jalan Nelasti and the semi submerged Joni Sunken Bar restaurant. Classier up market hotels like the Bali Padma Hotel on Legion Beach offer more relaxed entertainment. 